today in this video we're showing you how to propagate succulents using offsets and today's plant is going to be Fulcaria tigrina, tiger's jaws. Hello, welcome to John Horsey Horticulture. We're here to help you develop your gardening skills such as showing you how to propagate different plants, how to grow vegetables and much much more. So if you enjoy learning those things do consider subscribing to our channel. That means you're following us, there's no extra charge and don't forget to press the all important notification bell. It just lets you know every time we upload a new video. Right, I've got another little, little um, succulent here which I want to propagate. This one's called Forcaria and it also goes by the name of Tiger's Jaws. And if you look at it, you can see why. Look, it's got those little spikes in there, which are facing inwards. And, uh, you know, they do look rather aggressive, don't they? Anyway, it has lovely yellow flowers later on, and I'd like to propagate it. So this one I'm going to just pick out now and see what we've got here. Well, it's quite dry, so that's um, probably a good thing. We can see what we're doing. And he here we've got you can see these little pieces here which will come off. So I'm going to pull one of those out of there. And it's come away with a root which is even better. So just a question of tidying up that. Putting it to one side. Tidying up that piece there. Oh that's got quite a big root. This is more of a division than an offset. But you can see we've got a nice little plant there with a root. The parent plant still has plenty of roots on it. It's actually sending out more little little offsets there. Look, take all these dead bits off. Put it to one side, and I'm going to take another one out there, and I'm going to take that one there off as well. That's really got no roots, so that's a proper offset. But there, there's the parent, and it's got some more babies coming. Here's the, here's the, the 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 parent plant. That's going to go right in the middle. Give it plenty of room. Get the Soil down around the roots. Don't put it too deep. It's much better to have it too shallow. The succulents too shallow than too deep, because they will rot. There we go. Firm that one in the middle, and then I'm going to take these little offsets. And that was got a root on it, so I'm not going to touch that one. Just going to make a little hole down the side. Push the roots into the hole. Get the offset at the right depth, and there we are. I've got. Four, so we go one, two, three, four. So here we go. This one, lots of nice root on there. So take the dead off. I have to make quite a little hole to get this one in, I think. So this is where your fingers are so good. Down we go. Make a nice deep hole. Make sure the roots can go right down as they are. They're not supposed to come up. They're supposed to go down. So we push them right in. Put the soil back around it. Firm it back around. There we are. Done. And. This one here, you can see there's a slight root, small root on that one, so that will do. I'm going to take that dead piece off there and push this in. In that goes. And this one hasn't got any um, root at all, so it's what we call a true offset. Um, and I'm just going to tidy that up, just nick it off there to give a nice clean surface, which mm -hmm. will root better. And that could just be put in there and we'll just uh, put the label back in, give them a good water. I should put them somewhere a little bit shady to start with, just for a couple of, for a week or two, until they're obviously rooted and growing away, and then um, they'll go in the full sun again, and we should have flowers later on in the year. Well, that's all for today. Thank you very much for joining us in our Somerset Garden. We very much enjoyed having you. If you enjoyed learning that and would like to learn more, do consider subscribing to our channel and don't forget to press that all-important notification bell. It just lets you know every time we upload a new video. Until next time.